Hey guys, Abner Miranda here. I want to do a real short video for you about the targets that I use. These are targets that I get from uh, Challenge Targets. Um, I have, I've bought 12 of them. In fact, there's a bunch of them there and a couple more over there and these guys over here. Um, I have a lot of these. I love them. It's what I use for teaching. They're very light. Um, the entire target is probably in the, the whole thing meaning is probably like in the 25-ish, 25, 25 30-pound range. But the target plates themselves are ridiculously light. They're quarter inch steel. Plates themselves are AR500 um, hardened steel. And the reason I like these is because of this right here. When I saw these, originally they used to have kind of more of, a, of an android looking humanoid shape. But it had, it had the torso, it had the neck, it had the head. But it didn't have the ears. And the ears add a level of humanity to these targets that really truly adds a level of realism. Here's why. When you use a stencil and you put a face on it, that looks like a person looking back at you. When you look at these targets, which one of these really says go away? Which one of these really gets your attention as a bad guy? <clears throat> as a bad guy. And of course it's gonna be that one right there. Whether it's up close or whether it's at a distance with these targets back here, having a face to look at, just like looking at that face, totally dramatically changes how you deal with that target, how you approach the target. Um, I've put these up before and people have gone, whoa, because it really truly does get your attention. That face stencil that I use, um, I have to find it. I, I, I gotta remember the name where I found it from, but um, found it online. You can actually find these things easily. Basically, it's steel target face stencil, and you'll probably find it very easily. But um, these things are great, I love them. Um, that's it guys, I just wanted to show you, when you put a face on a steel target, it totally changes how that target is viewed by the, by the student, and it, and it renders, it renders a, a, a level of realism, and it focuses a student's attention. Not to mention, it gives you very distinct aiming points. You'll notice where these hits are. These hits, this one not so much, but this hit right here, is in that inverted triangle, and this is a direct hit to the brainstem. That would be back here. So that hit right there is an, is an instantaneous switch off on this guy. So not only does it lend a level of realism, it also um, gives a student very distinct aiming points so that they can learn a lot faster because you learn the fastest when you shoot steel. Remember guys, everything I do at Tier 1 Citizen is to help you realize your potential.